Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, actually, we're talking about something that wears out that people don't think that wears out. All right, stay tuned. So guys, um, we know being in tennis that things wear out, right? Strings wear out, obviously grips wear out because we're changing them all the time. Rackets wear out and they get softer, more flexible, um, strings break and you know, everybody changes these grips every time after every time they play. Obviously shoes wear out right shoes wear out um, your pants get faded or your shorts get faded you get holes in your shirt right you sweat through your cap uh, pretty much everything in tennis wears out and you have to replace it but my buddy eugene brought up a great point and suggested that i do a video for you guys because you know people keep this thing for forever and never change it thinking that it never wears out so what am i talking about i'm talking about these little guys here and everybody all say it together with me it's a dampener so, did you know dampeners actually wear out? I bet you didn't. Eugene was playing with his buddy Anil over at uh, Golden Gate Park, that new facility. And um, Anil was complaining like, man, my racket, there's something wrong with my racket. It's like vibrating. Um, he had just gotten a brand new string job. Um, brand new overgrip and it's essentially a brand new racket uh, we're talking about maybe six months old at the most and he's like it's like vibrating he's got a dampener in there but why is it vibrating so and this wasn't the first time it had been going on for weeks to months so my buddy eugene the rocket scientist that he is said let me see that dampener of yours. So he, he said, I think it's your dampener. So they basically, they both use dampeners, so they switched dampeners, right? Immediately, it went away. The buzzing went away. So Eugene and I talked and we were like, you know the dampener can actually make the vibration worse. And I was like, that's interesting. I actually never thought of that. I mean, you guys know I don't use a dampener. So, um, so I said, you know, I actually had a dampener that was a baby blue, kind of like a blowfish dampener that uh, came in one of those assorted jars. I don't know if you guys have that. But when I put it on people's rackets, they actually complain that the thing buzzes so there was something wrong or it didn't touch right in the strings that made it literally buzz and vibrate more so when a dampener wears out i mean you can see that this is soft like i can you know it's still rubbery it's you know semi-firm uh, but it bounces back as this rubber hardens up over the years um the uh you know the suppleness and the 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 rubberiness uh, hardens up and then basically makes it vibrate actually if you think about it right because it's now like a hard piece of plastic instead of a soft piece of plastic so that makes a lot of sense to me um do you guys remember those sampras o dampeners i want i wish i had one to show you guys those little O dampeners that with the little circle in the middle and he would put it right there. Um, 
on those dampeners, I know for a fact that when they first start off, they're a perfect circle. After they've been in here for a while, like they're barely touching the sides now. It's kind of like an it becomes an oval. It hardens up. And I will bet that that will not be dampening anything anymore. At that point, it's like an ornament. So dampeners, after a certain amount of time, the rubber dries out and basically stops dampening shock. It actually becomes um, actually worse and makes the vibration worse. So guys, I'll bet you guys didn't know that, you know, like this is a nice, it's nice and soft right now, right? This Japanese tea leaf is nice and soft right now. But when it hardens up, it can be a vibration causer instead of a dampener. So change these guys out uh, if you feel some vibration because, you know, it's a couple dollars. Um, you know, kids have like dozens of these and uh, they do take out a bunch of the sound. They do take out a little bit of the vibration through the strings. Um, but if they're not new, like your strings or your grip, uh, they don't help you, okay? Want to thank Eugene for suggesting this video. Um, I never even thought of this uh, because I don't use one. So, but for those of you who do, now you know, okay? Change your dampeners. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.